Hello YouTube, it's your boy Vintage Sterling Finds back for another Facebook Marketplace watch haul. Now, the guy actually messaged me. I've done business with him in the past and he offered me everything you see here. Um, sorry, this, a box of watches, a bunch of straps, everything for $100 Canadian. So, we're going to unbox it all right now. I haven't looked at it. I just gave the guy the $100 and came home. So if you like the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. We're trying to hit a thousand subscribers. I love hearing from you guys. And let's get into it. There's probably a hundred watches if I had to guess. First watch, carriage. Nice watch. Oh, made by Timex. Good sellable watch. We have a pocket watch. Is it going to be new or old? Yeah, new. Not much I can do with that. Next up. Oh, that's nice. Buff out the plastic. Digital and quartz. Or sorry, digital and analog. Somebody looks like they didn't know how to open this. That's a nice watch. Nice and shiny. Next up we have an... Advance, Japan movement, okay, battery works, surprisingly, Timex, Great Britain, probably from the 60s, needs a new bracelet, little bit of polish, but it runs. Nurse's watch or a nurse that, or watch that would go on a chain. Does it run? No. Not a big deal. This one's nice. Great Britain. And it runs. Strap needs a cleaning, but that's overall quite a nice little watch. Buff up the plastic. This one's neat. Timex, probably 70s, Great Britain, maybe early 70s, even maybe 60s, does it run, doesn't want to, see, does it run, yep, I can change the um, plastic because it's cracked, that's a nice little watch, this one had me excited, but it's nothing designed to look like a Seiko 5. This is nice. Designed to look like a Rolex, but look how shiny it is. Timex. Buff that up. That's a nice little watch, that is. Next up, we have a Seiko. Oh, mechanical wind. Not bad to watch, good shape. And, yeah, I can hear it running, so that does work. Timex. I think, oh, is it a mechanical wind? Oh, it is, okay. I thought it was a battery one. Those Timexes sell pretty well for me. This is a no-name watch. Bad condition. Not much I can do with that. <laughs> Timex Electric. From the 70s. Polish up the plastic. If it works, that's a nice little watch. I will change the bracelet. This is a um, Casio bracelet. Not appropriate for that watch. Last watch of the bag, another Timex. Does it run? Yep, it runs. This strap's not the best for it. And um, I have a bunch of these that don't run. I'll probably just switch the plastic with one that runs. That was the first bag. Now let's look at the next. Next up, we have a bag of straps. I don't believe there's any watches in here, 
But even so, that's a nice vintage Timex strap new in the box. We have smaller ones. These are hard to find, so that this is a good score. This one's a little bit broken. This is nice. Who made this? Stainless steel tops. Pretty common brand. That's hard to find one that opens like that this size. Red. That's good. These. Oh, fossil. Okay, because I've seen these before. These are for like the um, the big 50 millimeter watches. These are worth some money. These are hard, hard, hard to find. I'm glad I found this. These alone new are like $30 each, if you, if you can find them. This, I believe, is for an Apple Watch, if I'm not mistaken. Another small band. This is nice, too, if the watch is smaller. Who made this? Oh, no maker's mark. Does it work? Yeah. Good, good. A couple other small ones. One of these. Okay, good shape. Okay. Couple, yeah, a couple spring bars. White one. Not bad. Now, let's move on to the biggest box. So, I have the box on my lap, and I'm going to show you some of the bigger items first. So, first up, we have this quartz pendant watch. Kind of cool. Don't know the year. I assume it should work. Brand new in box. Kind of cool. Next up, we have a um, an alarm clock. Has a bunch of pieces. It's a Dell. Two jewels, a little bit rough condition. Yeah, it looks like it's been messed with. I'll probably, there's parts and pieces in the bag. I don't repair these things. I might play around with it a little bit. Next up we have a, that's kind of cool, battery in it. Tie. Not, we have a pocket watch, a Comta, doesn't run. Next up we have a Timex Quartz, nice condition. These Timexes are fast sellers for me. Nice watch like that, I'll get at least 40 bucks for this watch. Nice little watch that is. This is a Zandu, Japan Movement, I'll look this up, it's kind of funky. Kind of a neat watch. I've never seen one like this before. Definitely should be looked up. This is a Tradition 17 Jewels. Good shape. Uh, I think the click spring's broken. That's a pretty straightforward fix. Because if it's the main spring, it'll just wind, 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 wind. When I try to wind it, it flicks back. So yeah, it tells me the main spring has pressure. But it probably just needs a click spring. Pretty straightforward fix. Pulsar quartz, but yeah, crown's broken, rough shape, straps okay. And there's no particular order, just stick it in my hand in the box. This one, the straps upside down, no back, not much I can do with that. This one kind of caught my eye, it's a Larina, Japan Movement, kind of a neat NATO strap watch, how it would go like that. And then, it's kind of neat. I've never seen that before, and I own a lot of watches. Timex Waterproof. I believe this is going to be Mechanical Wind. Now can we wind it? Is this a, yeah, no, oh, maybe, maybe not, oh, it winds, you just have to be a little bit firm with it, 
beautiful watch. Does it run? I'm going to say it doesn't run. Let me wind it, but not run. But I can always look it up later. This is just a fast video. Astrosonic. Unfortunately, the screen's damaged. These sell quite well, too. I have a couple of them. I'll keep it, though, because the back constantly misses. The strap. Even the face is quite nice. So if I find one that's scratched, but the insides are good, I can always switch the insides. Folio. The straps nice, that's about it unfortunately. What are you a, a tug? Yeah, bad condition on that one. The strap caught my eye on this one. I mean I like the mother of pearl. The strap's kinda neat. Yeah, but unfortunate Japan movement. That's kind of neat. I might try to sell this one. Good condition. Kind of a neat watch. Not a super expensive watch. This is a Swiss made. I can't get that. Will it turn? Lady something. Yeah, I can't get it to turn or even open. Kind of a neat watch, but don't think I can fix that one. Or you never know. Geneva. No. Oh, it runs. Yeah, condition's not the best. Modern watch. This is a Timex. Okay, Indiglo. These are quite good sellers. I bet you somebody taped it because they couldn't get the, um, they didn't have the watch press. Because these older Timexes can be very hard to get the back back on. But, um, yeah, a little bit of corrosion up there. But I'm sure I can get that watch going. Carriage, oh, strap's broken. Not a huge deal, that's fixable. Timex, clean watch, good shape, k -cell. these guys, I have tons of spring bars, basically you push the um, this pin in, then it turns, 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 turns to set the time, I've sold a couple of these, these sell quite fast, nice watch too, good shape, this is a Timex electric, kind of an old school 70s, a little bit twisted. There we go. Now it sits flatter. Hopefully that works. I like that watch. That's a neat old watch. I hope that one works. England. This one says Taiwan. The strap says England. Older Cardinal. Yeah, it looks a bit rough. What's this? Oh, this is cool. Look at that old. See, it ends in 74, so it's a 74. Fortunately, it doesn't run right now, but that's just cool all day long. I hope I can get this one working, because I'd love to sell that. Okay, I shook it, and it clicked a couple times, so hopefully it's not too, too bad. Oh, wow, is this what I think it is? Can I open it? Doesn't want to. Oh, do I? Is my nail? Oh, there we go. My nail's in the wrong spot. I had trying to pull the whole thing. ESQ. That's a nice watch. Pretty, not bad condition. Put the strap in the ultrasonic cleaner. Couple scratches on the back, like somebody didn't know how to open it. But all in all, that's a nice watch. I hope that one works. Wow. Doesn't have... Looks like all the diamonds are there. But no maker's mark. No stamp. That's just wow. Timex Expedition. 
a little bit of polish plastic that's kind of a neat watch probably about 30 millimeter if I had to guess I like I'm a huge Timex fan they're good watches well made good price Cardinal quartz dress watch clean it up a little bit strap it'll move this is a Eddie Bauer conditions quite rough straps the wrong size maybe pass on that one this is an orient 21 jewels cracked oh runs great so um i'll see if i have the same another of those plastic crystals for because the straps in good shape it's a nice watch we have one of these Expo 86, Vancouver, a couple scuffs. These sell for probably $40, $50 Canadian. This one has some wear, if it works. Made by Swatch. We got a Rolex. Yeah, too bad it's not a real one. We have a Stacken. Yeah, this is missing. Oh, is it the crown there? But why would somebody... Oh, all the... Yeah, it's a bit strange. I don't know why somebody would have done that. Pulsar Quartz. Nice strap. Clean watch. Definitely sellable. Next up. Oh, we have a Christmas watch. China, yeah. Carvel by Bolivar. Watch has seen better days, unfortunately. Yeah, this one's US Polo. Does this slide? Okay, it slides. But that's not in there well. Quartz China, yeah. Look at this cuff watch, broken spring, no name. Okay, this is nice, Pulsar by Seiko, clean strap. That's going to be a sellable watch. Just a bracelet. Quartz, Main China. This is a carriage nice little watch good shape definitely sellable more here than i thought here's a nice watch fossil has the cuff small small wrist for this watch but i mean it's clean so somebody should buy it next up we have a timex doesn't run but a nice watch Carvel, now what are you, N7, 1977, fully wound, doesn't run right now, I hope I can get that one to work, that's a nice one, Tradition, Quartz, here is a Timex, doesn't run right now, Here we go. This is nice. Roots. Good condition. Big watch. Somebody in Canada will love this. People love Roots watches. I've sold a couple of them. PCA Quartz. It runs. Not a bad little watch. I saw this guy. I hope this works. No. Oh. That's a good sign. I picked it up and it moves, but it won't let me wind it. Okay. Hopefully that one works. That's an expensive watch if it works. Timex Electric. Hopefully that one works. That's be worth a little bit of money if it works. Timex. Doesn't run. Oh, and then Nordam stopped. So 
but hopefully I can fix that one start because it starts and stops. This is a signature. Don't know that brand. Kind of cool with the um, American coins like that. They're not real coins, unfortunately. Hudson, rough condition. This is like, looks like a, like a lock. Like, yeah, you'd press this, pull it, broken. Cardinal Quartz, that's a nice little watch. That'll definitely move. Timex Quartz, same way you push it in. Spidel strap, not bad condition. This is kind of neat, older Timex. Cleaned up a little bit, needs a new strap. Nice little watch. Another Timex electric. Strap's in pretty good condition. Oh, I see it's like metal. Never seen that before. I hope this one works, that's a nice little watch. Timex seized. Leetron, that's kind of cool. Clean it up a little bit. New battery. Hope that one works. Guess. No strap. What's this? Cardinal. Just needs a new strap, but that's kind of a neat watch. Very ornate. That'll move. Ring watch. No name. Yeah, no name on this one either. Timex. Doesn't run. We're getting down to the nitty gritty. Couple more watches. Timex. Seized. What's this? LC Quartz Armtron. Looks broken. Maybe we're going like a necklace. It's missing its. Oh, I think it's this, the Buffalo. Timex Quartz. Nice little watch. And like I said, all these were 100 bucks. These are by Timex. Nice little watch. What's that? Don't know. This is nice. Carvel Quartz. T2. I think T2 is 92. That's a nice little. Hopefully that runs. Nice little watch that is. Don't know that company. Another. Acura? Probably mispronouncing it. Daniel David Broken. George, I believe that's Walmart's brand's watch. Like a pen, but it's broken. And last one, guess. So that's all the watches. Thank you for watching. And if you like the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you on the next one. Thank you.